Hi guys, Howard Hings. I'm just showing you quickly today uh, a handy way, a bit of a hack how to keep your knife sharp if you're out and about or hunting or whatever. So basically what we have here, I have a Mora Classic. Um, it has gone a bit dull, it's not sharp now really. Um, it's gone a bit dull but there's no uh, chips in the blade or anything like this. Okay, So this won't take chips out of the blade, you're, you're going to have to go back to a, to a water stone to do that. So basically we have the window here of the Jeep. And uh, at the top of the window, it's it rounded, and it's I suppose very similar to a ceramic rod. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I just firstly find my angle like you would on a stone, which is very easy with a Scandi grind like this. Okay, and just, just stroke it towards myself. Find the angle again. So we're going from heel to tip. Okay, that's that's quite tooty now. Okay, so just to smooth it off a little bit, I'm just going to strap it on my jeans here. Okay. Okay. So I have a bit of paper now. We're just going to give it a paper test. Okay. So hopefully it'll cut through this with ease. There you go. No problem at all. that isn't catching anywhere so that's a handy way just to put a good sharp working edge back on your knife okay like I said it works as long as there's no chips gone out of the blade if your blade is chipped obviously you're gonna to have to go back to a diamond stone water stone carborundum stone whatever you use but just when it goes a bit dull and, and it loses that loses that kind of tootiness this is a great way to get it back up okay guys I hope this helps we'll see you soon